These mosquitoes are eating me alive. Oh, oh my gosh, it is one. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's insane. That is awesome. Wow. Holy crud nuggets. This is Costa Rica for you, are you ready? Check that out. He, he is really chilling here on this bed. Where are we going? Costa Rica. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. <laughs> Alright guys, after some long airport time, we finally made it to the little village that we're staying in. To get to this destination right here is about 20 hours or so. Don't mind the bruise on my nose, I face planted. <laughs> Usual typical me, you know? Oh my goodness. Come here, you. We just decided to walk into our room. Well, we have a cat now. You are just very pretty. Well, look. Bye. Nice meeting you. Something you guys got to know. This is a very last second trip. Literally decided to come to Costa Rica two days ago. That's right. Yep, two days ago. All this greenery behind us is where we're gonna be walking at night. We made some little dog friends. Oh my goodness. You guys are nuts. So right now we are walking around scanning for really anything. Eyelash vipers, vine snakes, birds. I don't know how it's gonna go, it's pretty warm, but we'll see. Holy crap, holy crap. What'd you find? There's a green vine snake right here I just spotted. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, it is one. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's, that oh vine my... snake is gonna eat you alive. <laughs> vine snake, ow, mother, ow, 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 ow. Okay, I guess that hurt. <laughs> Dude, green vine snake, that's insane. That is awesome. Wow. Oh my gosh, we were just talking about that just a second ago. <laughs> wow. Yep. Look at that. Oh, oh my dude. gosh. There he is. This but he's is got a green tongue too. An Oxabellus right here, folks. Nice. The vine snake curse is truly over. As the first snake of Costa Rica is a vine snake, he nailed me good. Tagged you. Oh, I was very shocked at how painful that was. <laughs> this was a huge, huge target of mine. Dude. Look at that snake. Oh. Holy crud nuggets. Oh my gosh, I'm ecstatic right How now. How did you see that? He was a foot into the brush. I know. You? Dude, that was the snake I was hoping to see walking just now. That is wow. awesome. Wow. Just right off the side of the beach. Oh gosh, and he's grumpy. These guys are very, very good at blending in. They're arboreal. This dude's got a bright green tongue, which is super, super cool. And these guys are just wicked climbers. Just like any Oxabella species, they're just really, really good at what they do. So right now, we have our big cameras. I'm trying to get a picture of these darn macaws, these green wing macaws. Macaws flying over right there. I've seen the scarlet macaws here in Costa Rica before, but never the green wings. And they're dropping the nuts. It doesn't sound quite right. Sounds dirty. There is a, oh, right there. Stay there, you McCall. It's hard to get them sitting in a good place because I'm just sitting here vertical. Fingers crossed for a good photo. Well, guys, as you can hear, it happened. Check that out. The great green macaw. Look at that. How cool. Good little guy. And. All right, guys, so we moved locations, a little bit of a jump. We are literally in a tree house in the middle of the jungle, working with some people that do a lot of work with the snakes. We are out here doing that, and we literally just got here. I didn't film us moving to a new location or anything. It was a very long drive, about four and a half hours. One of the species I wanted to see the most most here is an annulata, which is a species of boa. So we're getting our bags on, lights out, and we're going to go walk around and see what we can find tonight. 
This is Costa Rica for you. Are you ready? Check that out. Annulated boa. I can't say I've ever done a segment inside of the hotel room but or the treehouse room or any room that I'm staying in ever. This is a annulated boa and they are totally epic. <laughs> I am so happy right now. He, he is really chilling here on this bed. Although he is not venomous, it would suck to get bit by him. They have very large teeth, and I'm in the rainforest where I can't really clean my wounds super well. So we're going to leave that out of the question. I might get bit because I like holding snakes. Uh, so these guys primarily feed on birds, lizards. I don't hear of them eating a lot of reptiles, um, but I know these are mammal eaters and bird eaters and bat eaters. And these guys have a beautiful iridescent skin where they have some awesome pits on their face. They are just overall really, really gorgeous animals and I've wanted to see a wild boa for a tremendously long time, so I am very stoked about this. And he's just hanging out up here and it was within seconds of being here. We're just about to eat dinner and walk around. We're gonna see if we can find some fertile ants or anything like that. So it's gonna be really epic. I'm excited to get out there and walk, but there you go, annulated boa. Well, that's insane. Oh, let's see if I can, woo! <laughs> Gonna die. Oh, that's epic. <laughs> One headed tree snake. Very cool. First snake. It's still pretty small. Now they're annulated. Wow, up here. Just hanging out. That's pretty sweet. Yep. All right, guys, right here is a little baby, little baby vine snake. Look at that. That is so cool. Oh, you're wiggly. Hey, sit still just for a second. So this is a, oh, he's biting me. So this is a little blunt nosed vine snake here. He's not like the one we got earlier. He's a different species. They look very similar, but he is a different species. I. <laughs> Kind of a mess to see both species of green vine snakes here in Costa Rica, but that is, that is amazing. I am very, very stoked about that. I'm gonna have to snap some pictures of this guy. Right when I turned the camera off, big old fertile ants right here. Oh, there he goes through the water. Wow, look at that fertile ants go. Watch out, Todd, he's coming right at you. Check that out. Nice fertile ants. Wow. What do you think of that? It's pretty awesome. Check out. All right. All right. <laughs> Very fast. I mean, he got cornered and then spooked and then launched towards me and it just scared me super bad. I flew up <laughs> out of my position real fast. Little glass tree frog right here. Hi, little dude. There's a nice little yellow-headed gecko. Look at that. That is really pretty. Oh, there's a dart frog right there, actually. <laughs> Mosquitoes are eating me alive. All right, so here's the first eyelash viper of the trip. Really, really pretty. Just a little one. Christmas phase eyelash viper, super stoked. A little pineapple. That's so cool. This is a crazy looking. Hello. Hi, friend. How are you? Check that out. He's got a ride on your hat. Oh, I like that eyelash wiper, so they can have the different looks, but really, really cool. Good morning, everybody. It is the next day. We are out again today. Right now, specifically, I'm looking for the black and green dart frog. No freaking way. Lateralis, dude. No way. <laughs>